Infrastructure development is picking up pace in Honiara, the capital of Solomon Islands. Many locals are expressing their gratitude, saying they have significantly benefited from China-built projects, among which is the 2023 Pacific Games Stadium project. It is something that we Solomon Islanders will appreciate and are grateful for. In the past, we don't have any facility of this magnitude. Built by China Civil Engineering Construction Limited, the new stadium serves as the venue for the 2023 Pacific Games, which will be hosted by Solomon Islands later this year. The project employs as many as over 700 locals who have also received training courses to enhance their skills and expertise. This project of China has been dream of a very changing place for Solomon in this project. And with Solomon Islands, we're very happy that uh, China has been building this project in Solomon. This project itself has a big contribution to the local community, community and population. It provides opportunity for youths and small businesses. In recent years, infrastructure development has been kicked into high gear in the South Pacific nation. As one of the least developed countries in the world, Solomon Islands is eyeing less poverty and better livelihood for its people. Hence, the strong demand for better infrastructure. Betty Tamasi, a local employee of China Harbor Engineering Company Limited, appreciates the opportunity to help build a new university building, saying it has benefited locals in every single way. Um, it will accommodate a lot of students, and the facilities will be good as well. It will definitely help me to find, I mean, another job in the future. So the experience. As well as I can support my family because of the salary. China is now Solomon Islands' biggest trading partner and biggest importer, with a trade volume of nearly 500 million U.S. dollars in 2022. Going forward, the bilateral cooperation is expected to further boost the growth of the island country. I cannot thank you, government, enough for this wonderful, wonderful day. To the people of the whole world.